Hello everybody, it is itmog217, and today we're doing something quite different for this channel that will be a limited run of reviews, which is a Funko Pop series review. I have about, like, five of these that I can review, so, I don't know, this will be once a week kind of thing until, you know, I'm out of Funko Pops, which is a total of five weeks. Anyways, start off, we have the first Funko Pop I basically ever got. I don't remember how I got this one off the top of my head. Um, but I kind of opened this guy up before, just, you know, to take him out and look at him. But apparently he's number 66 for the Star Wars line. Again, I don't know much about Funko Pops. So, apparently you can get number 58, Ray, 59, Finn, number 60, Kylo Ren, 61, BB-8, 62, Poe Dameron, 63, Chewbacca, 64, C-3PO with a red arm, I think, 65, Captain Phasma, 66, the one that we're having a review here, uh, the First Order Stormtrooper. 67 is the Snow Trooper, 68 is the Flame Trooper, and, Trooper, and it says to collect them all. But, you know, this is based off the Force Awakens, as it says at the top here. So, let's just go ahead and open it up. I have no idea if this is like a proper way to open this up. <sighs> Again, I don't want to damage the box or anything. So you can see the backdrop has like a first order thing, and that's just giving me a reflection. There's this backdrop right here that has the first order logo, and that goes in the back right there. Yeah, like that. Just put that to the side. Nice packaging that keeps them pretty firmly in there. I kind of wish there was a tab there or something like that, just that way it doesn't so floppy. Just put that to the side. Huh, not that bad of a figurine. It's a bobblehead, of course. So, pretty cool, I guess. Nothing, I guess, is movable on these Funko Pop figures, like you can't move the arms. I don't think you can move the legs. Bottom of the stand says, oh, so I remember doing this a few times when I first got it. You can apparently remove the stand and such. Can't fit in the other holes. I think they're specifically made just for those holes, but I figure stands up pretty good for the most part, unless you do some pretty forceful stuff like I just did on the stand. Yeah. I don't know. I think this is pretty good. I mean, like... I'm a huge fan of Stormtroopers and such, so, I don't know, but it's, it's decently good, I, you know, if you have a, want to glue it in your car or something like that, I'm going to have a bunch of Funko fans yelling at me in the comments, I'm pretty sure, but, uh, whatever, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, review, I guess, of this Stormtrooper Funko Pop bobblehead thingy. Uh, leave a like if you want, and consider subscribing if you're into Lego, because I deal mostly Lego-related stuff, and, uh, if you want to see a few more of these Funko Pop reviews, uh, there, you know, just let me know what you guys want to see for my channel, but, yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in a future video. Until next time, bye!